know I've been pretty quiet on YouTube this last spring here. Um, been awful busy with the new treating system, but today I want to review or, or uh, give my opinion on this uh, Dickie John Intella Ag. It's a bus terminal, hand bus terminal based monitor system for this grain drill. Uh, it just plugs and plays with the John Deere 2630. We had we tried it out on a 2600. We had a little, it had a few issues. It didn't quite work as nice as it does on the 2630. I'll show you the monitor screen here. Gives you acres, uh, average uh, population that we're dropping, average in, uh, spacing, and uh, these bars right here shows the four different sensors that we've got on it. We got four sensors. Two on each tank. We're pulling a roller behind it. Overall, I'm pretty impressed with it. it seems to do a nice job. Uh, downloaded some maps off of uh, off the 2630. Uh, gives us a nice population map. Let's see if I can grab one. I don't speed up here. It's not good. didn't have this ready but here's a example of the map that's able to produce this this was a field we were in yesterday we got part of it planted and this is another field that we were in yesterday see a shot of it gives you some nice nice data on it coming out of fit studio but overall I'm pretty happy with it uh, for 1600 bucks uh, nice Nice little unit. Uh, we did have an issue with this tractor earlier this spring, and we had to uh, unhook it and put the planter tractor on it. We backed up, hooked on with the other tractor. It's got a 2630 in it. Uh, didn't have to change any of the settings on the monitor. It worked perfect. Uh, picked up exactly where we left off with the drill. Um, everything. You know, I, I couldn't ask for anything better. Back in the old days, we had had to have uh, two 250 monitors. And we'd have to have both cabs wired for it. Really like this CAN bus. Well, anyhow, uh, as far as weather, we've been having uh, some cold. There's quite a few reports of uh, frozen soybeans and, and uh, frozen off uh, corn. Uh, corn will bounce back. Soybeans, eh, we're going to have to give it a couple of days to see what happens with it. Um, but overall, I'd say we're probably 70% uh, done um, with corn and soybeans both. Maybe a little bit higher than that. A lot of the neighbors have reported that they're done. So, anyhow. All right, well, thanks a lot.